do this weird interpretive dance. Oh my this god. This is Runes' game right now. Yeah, I'm gonna put my faith in BSJ, monkeys, I annihilate, let's go. I know, he's keeping pace with Alina, but when you consider that Drow, Rubik, and Bane are all level 4, they're gonna be fodder for Chessy for quite some time, and he's only 800 gold away from a blink. Nice arrow setup though here, looks like they might be able to put some damage over on C Enigma. Not sure they have quite enough, oh, with Boris making the rotation, though they definitely do, and there's gonna be a nice first blood coming out for monkeys. A 10 minute first forever. blood. Yeah, but they follow up, they get themselves a kill on BSJ here on the top lane with a rotation from Chessy. Double damage on I Annihilate. This tower is going down. And the catapult wave. It is, but it's a bit squandered. I hope they're able to make a play aggressive. They can see. They, they can see Hanskin over here. Jesse coming forward. They all group together. Oh, the avalanche, the toss, the shadow poison. They'll follow up with the overgrowth. They use the Laguna Blade. That tree's actually going to walk away. And it looks like we are going to lose a Jubei. Double kill coming out for Era. That is the dream blink reveal for Jesse. Mm -hmm. I mean, that is so juicy. He gets both kills, and they don't even lose the tree. And Oof, that is very demoralizing for a team like Runes, especially considering they're in a great position at this point, but that, that really slows their tempo again, Chess. Oh, Boris. He was there. There was a Rubik there. Did you see where he went? You know, the shrine, just in case, still close in the vicinity. Should, uh, should he be needed? Gotta be careful if you're Bane. You, you get 100 to 0 right now by this tiny. Still smart. Most of them are pretty. Oh, the dump for it. Yules comes out though. Follow up with the Light Striker. All right, they've got the Laguna Blade. Nice disruption coming out here from Arrow. We'll buy a little bit more time. And now they're all on the retreat. Enigma looking for this opening. They drop a Sentry Ward. They know that there's someone there. They're trying to find it. Did they get it off though? Nice Light Striker, but they'll be able to go. Punch her into place. And that's going to be a kill for Chessie. And there you can see the strength of the TFT lineup. Even though they don't have Terra Blade, their team fight is so strong. Wrong. It seems as they rip them down during each of these fights. They really want this tower. Oh, monkeys? They see you. And they found someone else, too, obviously. They'll turn back around. Light Strike Ray. Couple of clips. Living it. Armor comes out, but they just go and use that Laguna. Yeah, dude, look at how scary those Drow Illusions are. BSJ yes. took a Soul Catcher and all of a sudden couldn't even man up on his own Illusion. Uh, you, you knock them down, they come back more powerful. Totally Obi-Wan going on right now for the side of the final tribe. You know, you take a fight, maybe lose someone, but come right back up, and the longer that this game goes, the better it is. Oh, Jube, not again. Jesse's dominating. You can't go, like, Kips actually calls that Mount Doom. Fine. Let's see one hell of a black hole here. You want us some fun? Crimson and Mech, ready to go. That's so scary. BSJ. BSJ, oh no. Nice telekinetic lip though coming out here from the roof. It manages to steal that avalanche. Turns back around. The overgrowth, no, the overgrowth, out. they punch him down. There's gonna be the Mech coming through though. Still gonna be able to take down that drow. And there goes a lot of your extra damage here. There's the avalanche. Jump forward coming out from monkeys. They gotta be really careful. They're grouped up so close here though. Oh, what a great toss back from Jesse. And then the blink out from Hanskin. This is so well played by TFT. They just just smoke in and go in. Pop all your cooldowns. Utilize the crimson, the meta, whatever. You get a kill on a core and a tower, and that's the thing. You can just rinse repeat now. It might look very, like very scary for the side of runes. When the Roche Monster is going down here in the pit, they know that they can't get, like, if they walk into that pit, they're immediately, they're dead. They're so dead, right? Because you've got the Overgrowth, you've got the Black Hole, you've got this big old tiny going on here, and of course you've got, uh, you know, your Terra Blade, like, yeah. each time. So, this is, the positioning is just so difficult against this team. This is like peak damage output for a tiny. I don't know the math on it, but Blink, Echo, AC, level 18. Oh, Look at no. this. Oh, Marana, BKB comes out. They've got the Laguna. They won't be able to take down the tree, but the BKB comes out over here on the Terra Blade. They've got the Fiend's Grip holding them into place, but it's just a deterrence for now to keep Iron Eye Light still alive. The buy that comes out here from the tree and doesn't I like want to uh, spend too much time off that map. And they're going to go high ground right now. They've got an Aegis over on the Terra Blade. But it looks like they'll back off. I'm surprised. Yeah, they had that buyback from Tree. I thought they were gonna perhaps in top lane. Yeah, oh, monkeys, 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 you are in for some trouble, my friend. It's gonna be the bunch of toss. DKB comes out. A couple of oh, leads no. here. Should be able to get himself out there. Go and use that Moonlight Shadow. They actually had the dust and they dust the Marana, but I don't think they're gonna be able to grab it just quite in time. And they'll come back in, actually. They wanna go and fight this tiny Liga. It comes out. Thunder comes out, though. You know, Thought's gonna be a bro. Keep him alive. And they're just gonna do a full retreat. You can see they're not, they have so many ways of saving their teammates. TFT. How do you kill any of these guys? I think that's what Runes is trying to figure out right now, Pat. <laughs> As Jesse gets himself another kill.
feels confident enough to like blink or leap into the fray and it just makes it so easy for TFT to position. How do you ever kill the Shadow Demon of the tree if everyone's so afraid? You need a pincer, but that's hard to do if TFT has got the moving advantage and they finally get able. Well, should be able to take him out fairly quickly here. Lock him down, Annihilates on a killing spree. So they don't have to worry about the Enigma right now in the black hole. They'll be able to take that shrine. Do they make another rotation here, Boris? He does spot out that there's a tiny over here. Manages to steal the tree toss again. Fiend Script's gonna come out over here onto the Shadow Demon. Destruction comes out the last second, but not long for that world. Immediately Arrow comes through. And that's the end of Era. That's he will just kind of hang back, too. Uh, you get off a really nice black hole. You just let your Terror Blade go about his business. Oh boy, monkeys. Gotta get in that base. And Meta's coming up pretty soon. And look. Oh, I annihilate. Yules comes out here. Buys a little bit of time. We've got that person turn back around. We've got the Sunder. They'll be able to go and try to keep him alive a little bit longer. Not going to be able to do it, though. Frost's going to get that kill. And uh, that is uh, I annihilate buying back right now. The BKB comes out here from Frost. He's going to get the Sunder up over onto the drown. He's just a menace right now. They're just ripping through these buildings. Again, look the positioning coming out from Enigma. He's staying very far back as his era. They've got the save. They've got this catch if necessary here. But they just cannot find this open. They're too afraid to go forward. Like you said, nice overguard coming through. He's going to the Meta Meteor Hammer. is actually going to get used as well. They toss the tiny lasers up into the air. Can they get the kill over here onto this drown? Not going to be able to. They take out Eye and highlight here, and now Final Tribe is feeling pretty comfortable in their enemy's base. Yep. Perfect star formation. You can see TFT, just everyone knows their role, everyone knows their position, and they're winning these fights, and it feels like it's just not difficult. They're just, it's easy. Oh no, monkeys, he's sitting so low, the last guy he hit gonna come through BSJ and for a lot of trouble here too, he's gotta run a little bit faster, we'll be able to go invis, and they're just ripping through this base, they get another kill over here as well, Boris, there's a black hole BKB, they're gonna use it just on a poor little Jube. looks like Ennis fan might actually get taken down here, it's BSJ, he wants his kill so badly, but he finds... I know, jeez. Yep. Final drive victory coming through here.